The Prince of Wales, who holds the honorary role of Commodore in Chief Submarines, inspecting the passing out divisions at Britannia Royal Naval College. Fittingly, the Royal Marine Band playing Christmas melodies at this winter parade to celebrate those who have undertaken 29 weeks of intensive training, transforming them into junior naval officers. A special day for them and for Prince William. <laughs> Britannia Royal Naval College still holds a very special place in my heart. It is well known that my grandmother and grandfather met here, while my great grandfather, King George VI, was conducting these very duties. It's not only that connection the Prince of Wales has to the college, but he also understands some of what these personnel have been through to get where they are. It was here Prince William started his Royal Navy attachment as part of his military training. He learned seamanship and navigation skills and also went out on the picket boats on the River Dart. His Royal Highness went on to serve on HMS Iron Duke in the Caribbean. The Prince's Royal Navy experience makes it even more poignant for those at this Lord High Admiral's Divisions Parade. We always say about the Royal Navy that sometimes it's quite difficult to understand the jobs that we do because clearly away at sea on the ships or submarines, um, people can't see the work that we do. So to have someone who's been on the inside and walked where they've walked, slept in the cabins that they've slept in, you know, ate in the same dining hall, that person will really have an understanding of, of the training they've gone through. And I know it will be inspiring for the cadets to see um, such a, a young, vibrant member of the Royal Family here for their passing out parade. As the formalities come to a close, the Prince of Wales takes the royal salute. And for one individual making the coveted march, it's her second time passing out at the college. It's, it's pretty surreal, having been here before as a rating and doing the same pass out again, but this time wearing a different uniform, marching through the main door. It's, it's pretty amazing, pretty special, and it was COVID last time, so my family couldn't be here. So to have my family and my friends here, and to have gorgeous weather and Prince William here, I can't ask for anything better. Passing out as a junior officer marks the next stage of a Royal Navy career that could take them anywhere in the world. So how does it feel? It's been a great experience today. Uh, to pass out in the Lord High Admiral's pass out in front of the Prince is totally exhilarating. It's not something a lot of people can say they've done. Uh, and it means it's the start of my career as a inspiring submariner and a future officer and this is the relaxing bit afterwards where you go celebrate with your family enjoy yourself a little bit before the hard work begins and it's clear to see family means everything i feel so proud of him i think from where he came from growing up with him to see him now as older confident i feel so proud of him and i think he's done amazing and as his young sister i really look up to him and i hope you know i can be as confident as him one day a well-deserved round of applause for the next generation of naval leaders. Bryony Williams, Forces News, Dartmouth. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.